This is an airsoft orange tip. You can find this on every gun that you can purchase. While this one is removable, this one is not. You can legally paint over or remove any airsoft orange tip if you would like to. Now a lot of people on YouTube say this, but they don't have any proof to back it up. This is ours. This is the Code of Federal Regulations, Title 15, Part 272, Section 272.1. This part applies to toy lookalike and imitation firearms, devices having the appearance, shape, and or configuration of a firearm. This is the important part. This part does not apply to traditional BB, paintball, or pellet firing air guns that expel a projectile through the force of compressed air, compressed gas, or a mechanical spring action, or any combination thereof. What that means is, once it's your airsoft gun, you can do whatever you want to the orange tip. Because it is an air gun, it does not apply to this rule. Now, in the case you do take off your orange tip, please treat it as a real firearm and keep it in a gun bag or just anywhere where the public can't see it because some people may feel threatened by it. Just use common sense. The one time you definitely need your orange tip on your gun is when you're shipping it. You don't want the customs thinking it's a real gun and taking it up. Okay, now for a lot of you, you don't plan on keeping your orange tip, and I know that. Okay? So we're going to give you some suggestions on how to destroy this thing. Now this is a pretty short video because it's a pretty simple rule. If you're shipping it, put the orange tip on, and if you're not, just treat it like a real firearm. This is Olive from Pure Recon Team, signing off.